previously on Vicman. Minecraft. Let's see what we got in the area. <gasps> we spawned next to a village. Ooh, look at all this farming area. Are any of these gonna give me stuff? Ooh, they are gonna give me stuff. Time to reveal the starter house. There she is. Look at all her beauty. A ruined nether portal? This is insanely cool. Oh yeah, baby, we're back. And today we've got a great mission ahead of us. So we're going to be going in to the mines, getting some diamond going, and then the moment we've all been waiting for since the last episode, we go to the nether. So we'll go down and get some diamonds so that we can get some obsidian going, and then we can hit up the nether and explore for a little bit. That's essentially what the goal of this video is going to be. So hope you guys enjoy. One eternity later. All right, we're down to diamond level. Now, let's just make a little bit of a spot right here. And then, we might. Ooh, some lapis. That's new. I hear a lava everywhere, oh no. Yo, this is scary. There's the lava. Okay, let's just bridge across. Just like this. What's over here? See some redstone. You know, all this open area, but no diamond hunt. Diamond! Let's go! Oh, that is perfect. Now just be safe. Oh, yes. Come to Vic Man. Okay, we only got two. I mean, we need three. But that's a great start. We will gladly take that. It doesn't even take too long once we've gotten to this, gotten to diamond level. Okay, so let's head over this way. Get some redstone. Might as well. Do love redstone up in here. <laughs> Diamond! I'm so happy. This didn't take long at whatsoever. <gasps> and we got more than Four, fa, 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 five. We have five. Oh my goodness! Wow, we are at seven diamonds. I don't think I've been this happy in a very long time. This. Oh. Oh my. So we have seven diamonds, so we have enough now for a diamond pickaxe. And that's exactly what we need in this very moment. Alright, so we have some diamonds. We have some sticks. So let's go ahead and make ourselves a diamond pickaxe, baby. Alright, so we still have four more diamonds. What can we make out of diamond? So we can make diamond boots and diamond weapons. You know, I think iron's probably good enough for swords for now. Why don't we make the boots? Just hang on to them. We won't use them quite yet. Now, we do want to make some protection. Um, with the iron we do have. So let's make ourselves an iron chest plate. And now, I actually don't know much about the nether, but I heard that golden items actually are very good to have 
So I'm going to make myself some golden boots. So we have adequate protection. You always want to make sure you don't leave home without protection. But also you want to make sure it's high quality protection. We don't want any broken armor up in here. When we're about to go into the nether. So. Let's go ahead and gear up. Let's go down and mine ourselves some obsidian. Well, I mean, that didn't look like it obeyed the laws of physics. That thing does not obey the laws of physics at all. I actually don't know how much obsidian I need. Oh, okay. No! Let's try it right here. Nice. Two very boring minutes later. Right, there he is. Our new nether portal. Boom. Okay. Alright guys, we've actually made it this far. I'm going to be completely honest. Episode 1, when I started this, I didn't think I was going to even make it to the nether. I thought, hey, I'm probably going to die to like a creeper. It's the classic way for a Minecraft person to be able to go out on hardcore mode, but I'm very proud that my first time on my Minecraft hardcore mode, we've made it this far. We found diamonds underground. We've found a bunch of like really cool things such as this nether portal. I am, all jokes aside, very happy with the progress we've made so far. So, it is time to enter. Assuming it has to be too big? I thought... But I thought... But... But... But nether... But nether... So apparently, crying obsidian cannot work. Guess we're going to get more. Six and a half hours later. Alright. So, we now have regular obsidian, because apparently crying obsidian cannot work for nether portals. Boom. Boom. Let's not risk it. Boom. Alright, so now we are at a nether portal. Alright. Let's see if you work now. Let's head off to the nether. Alright. Everybody, the one we've been waiting for, here we go. Ah! Are the gas? Gas here. No, chill, brother man. I say chill. Right, let's kind of take a look around. I haven't. I have no idea how this new update works. So it's very interesting looking around and seeing the vicinity. Bunch of new stuff. Wait, I think I just saw a blaze. Does that mean 
Oh, there's something with there's the enchanted skeleton. What the heck? How do you have that aim? Heal up really quick. I have no idea how you had that angle. We're continuing the adventure. Is this a fortress? It is a fortress. How on earth did we spawn next to a fortress? Game, I am very happy that you love me for some reason. So thank you. Thank you very much. So I think we're going to go back home for now and prepare for the fortress. So we have our nether portal. We now know where our nether fortress is. Next time, we got to focus up on getting some blaze rods and maybe even some ender pearls. We're on our way to making it to the ender dragon. Also explore the nether a little bit more maybe next time. But the fact that we have a nether fortress this early in the game Whew. guys this is coming out great hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like make sure to subscribe and i'll see you next time